guys, today I have my 100 chart because I noticed on our AMI homework, on the PBS homework, they're doing a lot with the um, hundreds chart this week. So I thought it would be fun to do some little games or some um, activities with our hundred chart. Okay? First thing I want to do is just count by certain numbers. Maybe we'll count by fives and some tens, and we'll just look for some patterns. How's that? All right. You ready? Why don't we just start with five? And if you notice, when I count, I'm going to look like I'm going back and forth. Because if I count by fives, I'm going to do five, ten, fifteen, twenty. I'm going to go back and forth by five. Right? Yeah. All right, ready? Five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty, thirty-five, forty, forty-five, fifty, fifty-five, sixty, sixty-five, seventy, seventy-five, eighty, eighty-five, ninety, ninety-five, one hundred, one hundred, five, one hundred, ten, one hundred, fifteen, one hundred, twenty. Did you get that? Good. Now, if you look on the side here, starting with the 10, you can see how you can count by 10s. All you're doing is adding one more 10 stick, aren't you? Another row of 10. So 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. 110, 120. Good job. All right. We're going to play a game. I'm going to give you a number. And then I'm going to ask you what 10 more would be and 10 less, okay? Just picture that I'm giving you a 10 stick, I'm giving you 10 more, or I'm taking a 10 away. Or picture it like a dime, 10's like money. If you have 50 cents and I give you 10 more, that would be 60 cents. Just imagine 10 more, all right? So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to, I'm going to have you close your eyes. Close them. Ooh, these are hard to get out of here. I don't want to knock all my numbers down. All right, you ready? The question is, if I have 37, right there, and I give you 10 more, what would that be? 37 and 10 more. Yeah, 47. Let me open it up here. Woo! 47, can you see that? All right, and if you can get, you can count 37, 47, 57, 67, 77. Yeah, you're just adding one more 10. You're adding a 10. Three tens, four tens, five tens, six tens. Do you see that pattern? Good. All right, close your eyes again. All right, this time I'm going to take. Hmm. Ah. All right, we'll got to cover it up so you don't see it. All right. My number that I was thinking of is 85. You see 85? What's 85 with 10 less? I take So instead of eight tens in 85, you'd have seven tens. Yeah, 75, right? 85, 75, 65, 55, 45, 35, do you see that? Yeah, you're just taking a 10 away. All right, let's try another one. All right, let's start with, um, close your eyes. Mm, so hard to get them out of here without knocking everything down. All right, my number is 24. 24 plus a 10. So 24 and one more 10. 34. 44, 54, yep, 64, 74, 84, so you get it. Okay, so 24 plus 10 more is 34. So you're just giving one more extra 10. Two tens turns to three tens. Good. What's 24 if I take a 10 away? Yeah, that's a little bit harder. 14. Because there was two tens and four ones. But if I take a 10 away, there's only one 10 and the four ones, 14. Good job. All right, so it's this week in your PBS packet, I saw that there's a hundreds chart. Um, just practice with your counting 10 more and 10 less. All right, good job.